Hey guys, good to go to my field. My name is Daniel, and today I'm going to be showing you how to go back in time, you know, to get the old scratch UI. Perfect. Old scratch is an old UI. You know, you missed the old scratch UI before it had this massive update. We have good news for you, my friends. We could get the old scratch up. What am I doing? Do this, have your account open, full screen it, you could go ahead and type in scratch.mit.edu, click enter. Instead of few, we want to go down, we want to go to download, undo resources, Mac OS, other versions, 2.0 offline editor, click that. Um, downloaded on your supported computer. In this case, I have a Mac OS, so then I'm going to download OS X and just DMG. I already have it downloaded. Go ahead, open up that DMG, uh, as I'm going to do right now. Install Scratch 2.app. and then wait for it to load. After verification access, click um, open. You just got coconut mold. Share this with all your friends to totally coconut mold them. That was totally unrelated to the topic recovery. So don't ask me why I put that in there. You know what, let's, let's just continue. Install scratch 2.app and then wait for it to load. After verification access, click um, open, and then wait even longer. After installation finished, well, I couldn't get the installation finished on Mac. Don't tell, don't ask me why. But did you know that there's also a couple more ways? The first way is just to go to this link. Link will be in the description or snap that. Berkeley.edu. Click enter. And no, no, not free. No, no, not that. Enter. Click one snap. And then here we go. You have your old interface UI. The other two ways worked on almost all computers. If it's a Windows, if it's a Mac, if it's Linux, but this one will only work on certain types of computers because only certain types of computers have time machines. You can go ahead and enter the time machine. Don't even get me started on that. That completely did not work. <laughs> and search the nearest. You, you scratch. Well, not 2010. And that's how you get the old scratch you want on your brand new computer. Yeah, that 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 doesn't that doesn't that doesn't make sense. This photo kind of seems a little short, don't you think? Anyways, guys, thank you guys so much for watching. Hope to see you soon in a brand new video. I'm not even supposed to upload today. Schedule right over there. I'll upload, I believe, on Friday. Uh, a real video that's not four minutes and seven seconds long. See you later, guys. Peace. <laughs>
Yeah, why, why, why am I even trying? Take 55. Imagine if this doesn't put in, get into the video. <laughs> yeah. Um, okay, three, two, one. Action. Okay, guys, so as you can see, I'm on my home screen, and I'm going to go ahead, and there's actually a third option to get to the scratch, I mean, to get back in time. You could go ahead and enter the time machine. Uh, it only works on some compu compu com 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 computers, you know, you know, I could just, I could just edit that out, you know, super, super simple, and then, oh, none of these buttons work, none of, none of these things work, how do I, okay. Looks like I'm going to be doing another take 56. Hey, wow. Where's my seed? <laughs> this is like the worst take ever. Come, come, come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. Oh, there we go. Okay, cut! Cut it! This is weird. Oh wait, one minute? <laughs> hey you, yeah you, who do you think I'm talking to? Yeah you, I'm talking to you. Click here to see my recommended videos from me. And click here to see um, your recommended videos from me. <laughs>